All right, I got one more reveal trailer for you guys now that I'm going to react to. It's Alan Wake 2. You know I was a big Alan Wake fan, and we played it a couple months ago, I believe. But Alan Wake 2 gameplay has been revealed. I'm actually super excited to see this because, like I said, I was a big fan of it. Nothing besides the ending. I felt like the ending was too extended. So I'm hoping that this game is just the right amount of hours. The other one was just, like, there was parts where it was too hard and i'm just like please just get this over with i'm tired of dying it could have been just me being bad who knows but this is alan wake 2 gameplay review i'm trapped here in this nightmare i write to escape it already looks Every so good word is a step forward <gasps> and it looks like pass. john wick I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. The graphics. It's right up your alley. Is it just me or is this the victim like was one of their own? It's just the video. FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. Robert Nightingale. So you knew our victim. Only the rumors. He was chasing a writer. Ooh, we're going back to the town. Someone knew they were here. Was playing a game with them. The killer left a message. Oh, we might actually. It's for us. The text is about us. We were all trapped in a horror story. We're not playing our story. Me. Wanted us dead. Playing the girl. This game looks insanely good already. What the fuck? Like, oh my god! Now this is a horror game. There's something. I'm forgetting. Something important. Oh, yeah. Something's not right. We're playing as both of them. Easy now. First things first. What's your name? Okay. Not gonna lie. Is there anything else? October 17th. Okay. So October 17th, Alan Wake 2 comes out. That gave me chills. That was actually insane. I'm, I'm excited. It's going to be on Epic Games. Why not Steam? Stop releasing stuff on Epic Games. The client is shit. That is... that Okay, the trailer was good, but that pisses me off. Stop having the Epic Games exclusives, because I'm not going to buy them on Epic Games. I bought Dead Island 2 on Epic Games. I bought Tiny Tina Wonderlands on Epic Games. But it's just like, the client is garbage only thing good about it is that you get free games a month or a week or whatever the hell it is but besides that that trailer was phenomenal i got chills it was i'm super excited that's how you do a horror game right there i know the first one wasn't i mean some of them actually got me in the first game but that's how you do it right there you don't do cheap jump scares you make environment actually scary it's atmospheric you get that airy music in there you make parts that make you not want to walk your, around your house at night. That is scary. And people say FNAF is scary. But FNAF is... So the first of FNAF, it's not scary. It's just cheap jump scares for 10 minutes and you're just like, oh, I guess I died again. But then you got security breach where you're being chased. You can actually get grabbed and die and you can get cornered. But with FNAF 1, you're always cornered. I know I'm going on to a FNAF rant, but... That was phenomenal. That Alan Wake 2, I'm so excited for that. I know I'm a bit talking with my hands today, but I haven't recorded in a while, so I'm super excited to get back into it. I've just been really busy, not really busy, just finding my way back into the recording mood. Been watching streams, been kind of down. I'm getting a cat this weekend, so. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video as much as I did making it. My name is Relic Ray, uploading videos daily, nightly, never sleep but lightly. I really hope you all enjoyed this video as much as I did making it. If you haven't hit that like button or subscribe button, please do so. I do upload videos daily, nightly, never sleep but lightly, like I said. And I hope to see you all in the next episode. Peace.